Hi, uh, I'm Miguel, uh, and this is my mother, uh, my mother Sarah. Say hello. Hi, um, Sarah. Thank you for watching uh, the next episode, a special edition episode of uh, Cooking with Miguel and Riker. Uh, as we told you in previous episodes, this was going to be the Mother's Day special episode, so we are actually recording this at my mom's house. Um, and uh, both Riker and I are doing the same thing, and uh, we're going to post it on uh, our pages, our social media pages, on Mother's Day. Um, so today, we, uh, I, got, I convinced my mom to just uh, tell me a recipe that she loves and that I loved as a kid. So today, we, she picked um, paella. Uh, for those of, the, of, those of you that don't know, it looks kind of, it's just a big tray of rice with lots of seafood, um, and it's amazing. I always, you know, I always loved it as a kid, so I'm very excited about this. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mom's paella. So you can't find this recipe online, but I will post it on the page. Um, I'll post the recipe since my mom made it, so I can actually do that, and this is not from plated. Um, so um, that's gonna take a little bit, uh, but since we're recording, we can edit a little bit down, so the video is not three hours long. So it does take some time to cook. 50 um, minutes. 50 minutes. Mm. Uh, hopefully... We'll since... be drinking uh, the... Well, yes. We have a special there too. <laughs> so yeah, to complement the dinner, uh, we also have um, sangria. Um, actually, red sangria. Um, uh, if you guys are not familiar, it's like sparkly red wine with ginger ale with fruit in it. Um, and it's really, really good and kind of Spanish on the Spanish theme. Um, it goes with it. So for the sangria, we have Lambrusco red wine, uh, well, red, red sparkling wine. Red sparkling wine. Um, we have a big bottle of ginger ale, although we're going to use half of it, uh, one liter. Um, we have one large green apple and one orange. And, one and we're going to put in one lemon um, to taste if you want, if you like it more acidic or not. Um, but in one nice jar that's going to be full in a minute and empty on the next. For now, let's go for the other ingredients. Um, here, I'm going to show you. Well, are you ready? Yes. I'm going to take this around and I'm going to show um, kind of what the ingredients are for the paella. This is a lot of seafood, as you can see. So uh, I'm gonna tell the ingredients. It's uh, one and a half cups of parboiled parboiled rice, rice, which is like a little bit longer rice than usual. Long, yeah, it's a long. You can find it every everywhere. Uh, one large onion dice. We have one and a half. It's fine. Um, three medium tomatoes. One red bell pepper. Two and a half cups of chicken broth. One cup of beer, which we do. And I didn't know this had beer. I just put it in there to. Give it a kick. There you go. I bet they're gonna love it. <laughs> no, <laughs> no wonder I uh, I loved this as a kid, um, and no wonder I love beer now. So uh, ten mussels. Um, the mussels my mom recommends the green New Zealand mussels. Uh, apparently they're really really good. They come in a box, and then you can find them also many many places. Good. We have one pound of calamari uh, cleaned and cut into rings. I know um, a lot of you have never seen calamari that is not deep fried, so that's how it looks. <laughs> this is how it looks. Yes. Eight clams. Um, clams right, right there. One chicken breast, um, skin and diced. <coughs> one and a half pounds of large shrimp and cleaned and please leave five. So these are the clean ones. And she says, okay. leave five with the heads on, so we can, uh, so you can decorate and dress the paella on top. And it looks like really Spanish. It looks like really Spanish, then. I know some of you are afraid of heads, of the heads of the shrimp. It's headless. Okay. Oh, they're no headless, problem. so good. No problem. Um, a, a cup of uh, extra virgin olive oil, two spoons of uh, saffron, and one and a half uh, tablespoons of salt, and two cups of green peas. So the directions, let me just put this back here. The directions are very simple and very short, but it doesn't mean that the you know the recipe takes about 15 minutes to total. So I'm gonna start making the sangria. 
obviously we have to, uh, that's part, part, kind of part of the premise of our show. Um, my mom's chopping the vegetables. So, mom, you want to tell a story? Story about... Uh, what? Get on a little camera over here. Yes. Okay, I'm going to tell the story how Miguel took the first bath. No, you're just oh, kidding. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> just no. kidding, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I'm no. not even drinking yet. And she's yet. not even drinking yet, but wait. She, yeah. yeah, for... One cup of that and she's going to be... <laughs> not too. <laughs> yeah. I, I just, uh, I'll just uh, pretend I'm not drunk on the first one so I can have a nice one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for those who don't know me, I'm Sarah, Miguel, Miguel's mom. I'm trying to fight with this, you know, chopper. Oh, is that working? I don't know. I, don't, I never use these things. I was still have <laughs> my little hands. Uh oh. Oh, I think, it, yeah, it's perfect. Oh, yeah, it works. It's with too many, with too many. I mean, I did put too many. I think that was my fault. Okay, so I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I love to cook. It's... Really love to cook. And um, I work, it has to be very small. Yeah, I know. I know. And yeah. See, oh, I'm doing. So there bad. you go. So okay. tell me where you where you work. Yeah, um, my husband and I have a coffee shop on Taylor Street, the Coffee Alley. Uh -huh. So, um, it, it, you know, if you go there and then uh, you said you're Miguel's friend, we can give you a treat. <laughs> a there you go. Or something with your coffee. There you go. And it's <laughs> happened before. So um, some of you have probably already been. If you're in Chicago, Taylor Street is uh, Little Italy, which is I love that neighborhood. Um, and yeah, it's pretty cool in there. Yeah, it's very nice. And then I hope to see you over there someday. And then I don't drink coffee because I'm too hyper. <laughs> yeah. Uh, if you... Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> yeah. If you know my mother, yeah, she can outdance you to four in the morning. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> I try not to. But you know, I don't drink coffee. I don't drink too much, but... Uh, I really like uh, sangria and margaritas. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, so, that's right. You go with your girlfriend. Ne next, you know, next year Mother's Day we'll go Mexican, okay? And we, we just have some tequila shots or something. Right. My 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 friends already, you know, tease me and call me Mexican, so that's just gonna be really? good. Yes, that's okay. Oh, I embrace it. Yeah, it's okay. It's A okay. lot of my American friends should just say. Hey, Anything, anything south of Mexico is just, it's Mexico, so, it's, yeah. so, and then when, yeah. <laughs> when I'm going to build a wall and what I'm going to do with it. And oh, we're going to build a wall, but, but we're going to build it around Donald Trump. <laughs> there we go. And everybody's going to be happy. We, um, yeah. Um, <laughs> Hopefully we don't have too many. <laughs> my my stepdad's not home yet, um, but I'm sure he'll be jumping in at some point today. Um, I'm actually wearing his apron. Um, his name is Bill, yeah. and it just says build, build master of the grill. The grill. Is it oh the yeah, grill? the grill. Yeah. Build master of the grill. I I love how that rhymes. So that's funny. And my mom has an apron too. Yeah. And it says. Sarah, domestic diva. Yes, say yes. Domestic. <laughs> right, she's never home. Yeah, but I love cooking. Plus, you know, my mom's birthday was two, just two days ago. I know, I'm still, you know, happy. Her fourth quinceañera, you guys can do the math. Um, <laughs> uh, she, <laughs> she's actually... That's not nice, Miguel. <laughs> We, you promised you we were not going to talk about numbers here. <laughs> okay, okay. So we have um, we had a, um, a good birthday celebration for you on Saturday. We went to a restaurant and we ate a lot of cake. And what else did we do? We, we had a great time with our friends. Yeah. And family. Yeah, we don't have too much family, but I consider... Well, we guess friends from our family. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, most a lot of you already know my mother, so. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't know me, come see me. <laughs> 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 You'll get to know me today, definitely. 
Yes. And uh, I, don't worry, I have a little accent. <laughs> a little. Just a little. And I'm not Mexican. So then it's like... Yes. And that's uh yeah. Um. Oh, this apples take forever to break in little squares. <laughs> I'm doing pretty well. I'm destroying the almonds. Yeah. Now yeah. I'm ready to destroy the tomatoes. I can't wait to see my um. I, you know, I'm excited about Riker's video as well because we're we're both been really wanting to do this with our mothers for a while. Um, so that would be really cool. That's a great idea, I think. It's set because I'm traveling the day after tomorrow. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tell them where you're going. Uh, we're going uh, to Thailand. Oh, can't wait. I, I've had a few a, a few friends that had been to Thailand and they've been they keep going every year. It must be really? amazing. Yeah. Oh I I can I can wait to, to go and enjoy all the goodies they have there, you know, going at midnight, you know, for dinner dinner. And then uh you know I I just I love to a different experience and I heard the beaches are beautiful. But we also are going to Vietnam and Cambodia. Wow. Yeah, so that's quite the trip. Yeah, we're gonna visit. I don't know that. I'm not that happy about it, but we're gonna go <laughs> visit the those the, the military things. The, yeah, the tunnels that way the Vietnamese used to hide there. Uh huh. So why are you not happy about it? I I, I think it's creepy. Oh, okay. Well, uh, but you know. Well, you know I'm a little chicken for some some. Yeah, I can I can, I can understand that. I don't want to see some other things, so I yeah. understand. Yeah, that's because you didn't go to war, so <laughs> I didn't go either, but my, I, mean, uh, I guess I have been watching too many movies. So. My, um, my stepfather is really cool. Um, um, they got married about six years ago? So, uh, we've been together for seven years and we've been married for five. They decided to get married in Las Vegas. In a yeah. little white chapel, yes. and we all flew there, and it was awesome. Of course. It was so good. <laughs> it was so cute, uh, and it was even uh, streamed live on the internet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. I oh forgot God. about that. Yeah. Oh, I remember. Yeah. I and remember. then we had a party here, but we waited like four months. Just in case, if we didn't know if we had to spend the money on the attorney, or, <laughs> or, <Mom>. or, <laughs> or we just uh, decided to have a party with friends, so we decided to celebrate. Yeah, it worked. We're still together and more awesome than ever. And he's super active. But he's not. Uh, he's, yeah, he is. He's doing what? Racquetball something he's right racquetball now? Racquetball right now. He plays softball. More exercise than me, for sure. <laughs> oh my god, this this apple takes forever to go to I, chop. I, I already destroyed two onions and I'm going to I know, to the but yes, remember, um, the front, uh, we're doing this show because I had no clue what I'm doing, so <laughs> I'm just going to chop Now, it. next time, I want to go to your home and then you could paella for us. Oh, right. <laughs> for the whole family. Right, thing. and I burn the place down. <laughs> Maybe I'll just chop them like, like you know, like chopping onions. Or maybe I can just use the thing that you're using no, no. for the apple. No. Why not? Because you have to learn how to chop things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. You remember, never give the fish. Just show them how to fish. Okay? Ne oh, never teach a man how to fish. Exactly. I think that's how it goes. No, never. Oh yeah, yeah no. What exactly. Is no. <laughs> Never keep a man to fish. Just teach them how to fish. Yeah, no, yeah, there you go. Uh, something like that, you know. Yeah, something yeah. with fish and learning. Okay, Miguel, hurry up with that sangria. I'm getting thirsty. I'm coming. And so, 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 <laughs> so close. Well, so close with the uh, the apple. I'm just gonna have chunks of apple okay. in the Okay, this is my workout for today, okay? Chopping this thing. This is 
is really good for your muscles. You just keep pushing. <laughs> it looks like it's working. I feel like working. Yeah. I think I'm I done. am. You're done? I'm almost done. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That's and I am done with peeling one apple. <laughs> Actually, chopping. But it's I mean, okay, that's what I put him out there because otherwise we are not going to be today. Hey. We're going to be having for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. You're lucky that yeah, this is a, not a live show, so we, we get to edit it. Oh, this will be like four hours later. So you're gonna no no you're gonna be like like you're gonna cut and then you're gonna put yourself in a in a like speed. Yeah. <laughs> so like, With Benny Hill. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Yay! I am done with the apple. I wow. Am not, All right. Uh, do you have a little thing to? Oh, just I'll just put it in on the yeah. jar. Yeah. Okay. You have a, is that a thing that yes. brushes? Yes. Okay. Thanks. And what okay. is it called? Food something? I got this, so I'm going to just start this pan. Okay. All right. In the meantime. You need a, this is for clean your hands. I have this too. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. Let me get you. It's a lot of this apple. This is one now. of my favorite. This is one of my favorite. Uh, uh, kitchen utensils. This one, I'm gonna put it closer. Mr. Right, right, and this is always right. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You gotta have one of this. <laughs> no? Yes. Okay, I have this. a lot of those. You get Mrs. 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 Right? No, this one is so oh, but is special. It Oh, there's some apple on the floor. Uh, Here, I'll just... Okay, apples and... It's a lot of apple, Mom. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm very sure. Okay. I love the whole thing when it comes to... So, food. and you need this with the... Yes, yes, it has to with have the peel skin. thing. But it has skin. to be very small pieces. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Okay. I don't, can I have a suggestion? Yeah. Hold on. See, you should... Peel it like like you peel onion. Oh, and then do like the little squares. Exactly. Okay. But as uh, we started already like this, that's fine. Okay. I it. can do it. Like these little sticks like a uh, French fries, okay. and then you cut it this way. There you go. Okay. Now we're that's gonna. That's mom and fries right there. Start this. But the other way because I'm left it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Like oh, look at this. Oil. It does say how much of olive oil? I think it was half a cup. Third of a cup. A third of a cup. Um, I use this brand. It, this is uh, many people don't uh, know about this oil. This is not it is uh, not very expensive and very good quality. It's Raconto, Italian. Yeah, because some olive oils can get really, really. Expensive. I've seen in the stores they have it like behind glass cabinets, yeah. and and the same with. Uh, balsamic vinegar like I there was this little store that I saw one day that they have balsamic vinegar that was like nine hundred dollars with this tiny little thing yeah I'm exactly like, why no they have to well there are some that they are really worth it most of them they are not all right this here okay I can cut myself. So far, it's been so good. Okay, uh, directions. What? Directions. Oh, directions. Peel and clean shrimps. We already We're did done, that. Done, done. Leave blah, 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 blah. In a paella or large pan, place the olive oil, diced onions, and half a teaspoon of salt. And wait for the onions to crystallize. So crystallize, it's, yeah. Actually, I, the smell, I, I love the smell of grilled onion. So it, 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 it gives a really, really good flavor to the orange. All right. Half of the orange is done. Uh, sorry, I make faces when I'm cutting things. Oh my 
almost done. And then we can get to drinking. <laughs> Even our friends over there, on the other side, I bet you guys are drinking already. Well, yeah. Usually, <laughs> usually, we, usually we just do shots, so it's like super, we start drinking right away. Oh. But I'm not going to make you do shots because I've seen the consequences. Mm -hmm. Oh, my stepdad's here. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm just cooking with Miguel. Yeah? Come here and say hello. Hello. Say hello. Right here. Here's my hello. stepdad, Bill. There he is. Oh, does it smell good in here? Oh, yeah. Oh, we, oh. Just, we just turned the thing, but yeah. It started by this. It does smell good all together. <laughs> so, what were you doing? Doing racquetball? Yes. Nice. Trying to stay in shape. That's good. Oh, it's kind of mysterious. Are there supposed to be two of each? Two of each, yeah. Two fish for right. you, two fish for me. Yeah. Okay. I didn't pay for them before. You did, you did. Huh? They said no. I had to pay again. Oh, Sandra. Oh, oh nice. Did you go there? Huh? You didn't go there. Huh? Playing racquetball. And Charlie gave it to me. Oh, Sandra, racquetball, Sandra. I got some here. How sweet. What do you get? Oh, is this a birthday gift? Your birthday does not cease. It keeps yeah. going and going. Wow, this is so cute. Oh, she doesn't know this is gonna go viral. <laughs> Look at so cute, and then oh my goodness, love it. Perfect for my trip to Thailand. And this is a little cute thing for the ornament. Lovely. Okay, the onions are crystallized. Yes, uh, almost there. Uh, when onion are crystallized, add the tomatoes. And when tomatoes turn intense red, add the diced chicken breast and cook for three minutes. Okay. Um, In the meantime. Yeah. And um, I want to show how crystallized onions look like. Oh, yeah. Let me uh, do that for you. Okay, I'm going to. Oh, sorry. There you go. It's crystallized onions. Yeah. Yeah, okay. it's so good. Yeah. Mm, smells good. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to add the tomato. Exactly. We're going to add the tomato with the juice that comes with. And now we're going to put, you know, a little more. Uh, oh, yeah. You didn't talk about. Um, yeah. So at the beginning, you're going to do high. Then when the onions start getting a little... Um, just to give it uh, 30 seconds and then uh, then you put then you lower down so it gets crystallized instead of burn <laughs> or caramelized we don't want it caramelized um, and then uh, then uh, tomatoes then you put the again the fire high on high so it doesn't get like a you know salsa for pasta or something <laughs> <laughs> like marinara sauce no, yeah you that's need that. good idea all right, while my mom does that, I am going to stop chopping fruit because I'm tired of it. <laughs> but start dropping the good stuff. Start yeah. dropping the good stuff, yes. So I'll put the oranges, oop, about that. Trying to get some of them inside. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I'm getting the cups ready. <laughs> okay, the cups are ready, all right. Glass is ready, see, whoop. All right, so you want me to get the entire thing? Uh, yeah, but put the sugar first. The sugar first. Oh, yeah, it's like half a cup. Mm -hmm. Where's the sugar? Here is Half a cup of sugar. Oh, half a cup is not much. No, it looks like. I mean, yeah, there you go. Yeah. All right. This is really good. Yeah, definitely not for fitness aficionados, unless it's your free day. Perfect. All right, now the entire thing? Mm -hmm. Put some, uh, some, so it's 
some of the soda first. Okay. Do the sugar. <laughs> <laughs> See what it says. Do you have the thing for are you using this, Mr. and Mrs.? No, you can you can get something else. Uh, we have uh, you know, you always wait, 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 the wooden spoons are here. Oh, wooden spoons come out. Oh yeah, you have a lot always, of always wooden always a wooden long wooden spoon. Alright, I am trying to glue the sugar first. Put a little bit of the ginger oil. This is a lot of fruit. You can probably refill this with another bottle. All right, now, That's two right. shots of vodka. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> you can add some, um, you know, a uh, control. You know what is control? Oh, control? Yeah. Yeah? You can add, uh, you know, uh, one, how do you call it? One of those little. One shot? One shot. Okay. Control, one shot. Maybe I'll one. try it. I don't want to have to work tomorrow. <laughs> and about half of this. Okay, I got this ready. Now what? Calamari? Uh, crystallized and tomato, chicken breast, cook for three minutes, add the saffron. It's, oh, where's the saffron? <laughs> <laughs> wow, that looks pretty. Add the saffron and then clams, mussels, calamari, and peeled shrimp. Mm -hmm. uh, all right, a little bit more. Okay. I want you to put some ice, right? Yes. Don't, don't mix too much because. Oh, the you air. Take the, the, uh, the carbonation. Yeah. The carbonation is all the Oh, where's your ice machine? Oh, you have an ice machine. Ice machine. Hold on. <laughs> Crush water. Ah, uh, two, exactly. Ah. <laughs> no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, why don't you open and try to? No, no, no. Uh, have, this has to. This is glass. There you go. All right. Go ahead, yeah. Okay, now let's put it in. This looks good. Or you want to go for rice, so. <laughs> More. Wow, that looks really How this is looking so bad they cannot smell this thing oh my god it smells, smells so good now so good yeah so all the seafood it's in there yeah part of it i'm gonna use oh yeah there's still it. more oh you need to put the clams now then we have to bake this too right yeah and we're gonna put it on, on the stove okay. you can either grill put it on the grill you can put it on the stove or you can put it in the oven. Oh, okay. Yeah, you either or. It takes a little longer in the oven. Uh, I like to do it on the top, the stove. The, it is easier for, for me. 
You can make a mini paella too, but usually this is a lot of work, cleaning all the stuff. So I like to make it bigger. And the clams now. Mussels. Oh, the mussels, I'm sorry. Clams are the other ones. Wow, that's a lot of seafood. Can't wait. We have eight mussels or nine, ten? Uh, ten. Nine yeah, ten. Yeah, ten. There you go. Ten. There you go. This looks awesome. You can barely stir that now. Yeah, well, that's good. That's okay. And now we're going to do the rice. Where's the rice going? The rice going in there. Uh, in the wood. Come. Now you put it very slow now. Okay. Okay, the flame. And uh, it's gonna get the rice. One and a half cups. One and a half cups. I'm so lucky to eat my rice. <laughs> Big rice. Oh. <laughs> I don't like when I eat. So. <laughs> That looks so good. All right, it smells so good already. So what is this? It's one and a half. One and a half cups of rice. Do you put it on the chicken broth or not? Well, I mean, I guess let's read. One and a half. Let's read. Perfect. All right. One and a half cups of rice. Put it in the right. Just dump it in there. Uh -huh. Add chicken broth and mix in. Oh, add rice and stir first. Okay. So that's the step. So I just put it, you know, it is like that. That's perfect, see? Mm hmm Just like that. And then now I'm going to add the chicken broth to it. We just added the rice and the seafood, and now we're adding the chicken broth. So spread evenly. Mm -hmm. Make sure all the rice is under the broth. It's okay because it's gonna be like a, a you know, a, we're gonna cover it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's delicate. What are you gonna do with this now? With? So we're, now we have to add the beer as well. Yeah, but we have to wait a little bit, okay? Until okay. It, it, it is. You go, but it's looking good. It's looking good. Yeah, it's starting to smell really good. Okay, we're gonna put this one hey, in here. I'm gonna stay, in the, I'll stay over there. Mm -hmm. That's okay. I'm gonna get in the way. Part of the family, it's okay. All right, uh, let me put this over here because I really need to get that sangria yeah. finished. That's so we're almost cool. done with this. Okay. All right. This is done. That's enough. Please. Please. <laughs> Are you going to be eating here? Yeah. Well, at least I can We're going to eat some more, so... Get, get another pot for... Do we have three? Yeah, we need three. Three. Step that. Let's join us. I can get okay, I'll get you. Okay. Uh, up there. Those, those. These? Yeah. Let me just clean up. Okay. All three, uh, the three of them like the same? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see what's here. Yeah, and you wanna go in the okay. one? Okay. You want me to just serve it? Yeah. All right. Well, this is gonna be a mess. Oh, not too bad. Mm -hmm. That looks beautiful. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it's beautiful. One. Ooh, This is better than being at a restaurant. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Now my stepdad is uh, part of our in-home studio, I guess. We always have someone uh, in every show. Oh, really? Yeah. 
Sometimes we have more than one, sometimes we have quite a few people. All right. I salute. My glass. So, baby. Mom? Okay, salute. Salute. Let's salute. try this homemade sangria. Yes. I salute. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Yes. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's very light. It's so it's so good. It's so good. It still has a kick. Oh, I'm gonna be making this all summer. Mm, it's really refreshing. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. Oh yeah. It's <laughs> really really good. So. Oh, you get your fruit intake too. Exactly. So, that's healthy. <laughs> Yeah, and that's what I always try to mix, you know? <laughs> but for example, I eat hot dogs with cucumbers, so I feel like I'm eating something good. Mm. Hamburgers with pickles, you mm. know? <laughs> I still add up and lettuce and tomato, of course. Fries or potatoes and that's it. Uh, uh, <laughs> a lot <No>. of carbs. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, so good. <laughs> Hey, let's do it like a Venezuelan way. Arriba, Arriba abajo, abajo acentro, al centro, adentro. Mm. Yep. I think, I think it tastes better because we made it from scratch and yes. it's like the fruit of our liver. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and no, no, I mean, it has the real, the fruit flavor, like so fresh. So, and mm. you can make it with white wine. So it's just really light too. So it depends I actually on just order it, but but you know, Spanish is usually uh, you know uh, red wine, uh, but it just well, really good. I love it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think somebody needs another bottle of wine here, my husband. <laughs> <laughs> He's just smiling behind the camera. Mm. Delicious. Nutting. Yeah, Miguel did a good job. Oh, beautiful. Let's follow the recipe. It's looking beautiful. Oh, yeah. Mm. Let me show you guys. Mm. Look at good, that. Looking good. Oh, you could smell it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. It smells like my childhood. <laughs> oh, you're going to make me cry. It's supposed to be Mother's Day, no crying mother. Making crime model. I know. <laughs> yeah, we have to do this more often. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's so cool. It's going in order. Well, I need to see my son more often, so you guys request that I have another <laughs> cookie day with cooking day with mom, okay? <laughs> mom, mom, mom. <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to put it on the poll. <laughs> <laughs> we have a poll every week uh, with what we're going to cook. Oh, and, really? Yeah, that's and then people nice. vote, and then we. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Well, mm. one of those clams is opening up. You what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah still they, alive? they were alive when, when I bought them this morning. <laughs> I mean, this afternoon. <laughs> yeah, definitely not for a pinna heart. There's a lot of. Black things and things with heads, but I, I like it. But I know people that I have to peel shrimp for they because they, they they couldn't see the, the oh, head yeah, of the yeah. shrimp. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't I don't like their eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want them to look at me, you know. But I'm trying to peel. Once we cook lobsters, fresh lobsters, mm -hmm. and uh, we went to the restaurant, the the you know the place that I get the seafood from. So they are still alive. So we come home. And I said, Bill, the, Bill puts the, the, we had a dog, a golden retriever, and uh, we put the lobsters there, and the golden retriever, and our dog, he was like, oh, <laughs> like freaking <laughs> out because the lobsters were moving like crazy. So then, okay, it's time to cook the lobsters. I say, Bill puts the, uh, the lobsters on, on the counter, and the lobsters start walking a little bit, crawling a little bit. <laughs> and then I said, Bill, I was screaming. Bill, you have to cook the lobster, otherwise no food here. So then he put the lobsters. I tell them to hold it, the lid. So the lobster starts cooking and he just starts, you know, getting all scared because what is this? What do I do? What should I do? So 
well, finally, at the end of the day, we had a great meal. Uh, we cried a little bit for the lobsters, but they Aww. were so good. <laughs> Glad we didn't put a name on it. Speaking know. of, where's your drink? Oh, mm -hmm. there it is. Yeah, yeah. I'm still, I'm still working. Just to make sure that she's hydrated. <laughs> Did you notice that I start laughing a little more? I'm very hydrated now. <laughs> 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 hey, viva la hydration. <laughs> <laughs> who, now, who watches? Uh, uh, just people that uh, you're friends with on Facebook? Yeah, um, um, we've had, uh, usually do it live. This is a uh, recorded, as I told before. And it's a special edition of Mother's Day. I'm doing it with my mother. Riker's doing it with his. Um, and then we're gonna post this on Mother's Day. Um, this is uh, going on all, you know, um, on all social media sites. So, uh, we have a Facebook page, we have a YouTube channel. So what's going on there? Nice. You know, the mix with the orange with the skin mm -hmm. and the green apple is so good. But you don't eat the skin, right? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. What? You do. I've been throwing it. No, you don't. You eat everything. That's why you have to cut it really small. So it's this, it doesn't matter, but it gives a special taste oh, to it. So, eat the skin. It doesn't matter how bitter it is. It is. Mm -mm. It's good for you, actually. This one is not bitter. No. Because you, you get the good, uh, good oranges, the, the big ones, not the small ones. Mm -hmm. We're not going to do that in Thailand, though. Hmm? We're not doing that in Thailand. <laughs> Eating it skin. Mm -hmm. Well, how long do we have to um, do this for? Okay. Until, until the water goes down a little bit, then we put the beer. And once we put the beer, so we can close it with the... With, oh, this clam was alive. You're cooking with beer? Yeah. yeah. Beer. Once the water goes down a little bit, the broth, then we'll put the yeah, beer in. Yeah, one, one, one cup of beer. Nice. And... Uh, That's what it gives it. And then you put the green peas and the salt and then cook again. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we can probably take a break and then we'll come back in a little bit. Um, mm -hmm. um, we need to um, go to the store to get another bottle of wine to make more sangria. <laughs> 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 All right, uh, we'll be back in a little bit. Um, stay tuned. Mm -hmm. Hi, and welcome back to our crew, a special edition of Cooking with Miguel and Riker. Um, as we left before, um, we were waiting for about 20 minutes for the broth to go down a little bit so then we can add a special ingredient, beer. Yes. No wonder I love it. Hmm? Um, yeah, right. Uh, what? No, no just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> okay. We've we been drinking a little bit now. Mm. I wonder how it tastes with the uh, sangria with, with beer. So I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna get you guys here. Oh my goodness, this is gonna give a special flavor to our paella. Only half of it. Oops. Only you only half it. or you wait? Only half, only half. Okay, so only half a beer. Yeah. And then you can drink the rest. Uh, it doesn't wrong with that. It's not nothing wrong with that. And then I can drink the rest. Yay. Yeah, exactly. We just Oh we don't, God, we don't so like good. wasting in here. It smells so good. It smells so good. Now I'm going to cover it with aluminum foil. Oh. So now, a jelly, oh yeah, add chicken breath mix, blah, blah, blah. Place the shrimp, the five shrimp left. You did that. Um, red pepper, uh, red pepper strings and cover with aluminum foil. So that's what she's doing right now. She's covering it with the red pepper strings. And I'm drinking with my sangria. Mm. Oops. There you go, one of the peppers. <laughs> there you go. So, and then after we cover it with a lemon fall, we still have to cook for another 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's a long process. It is. That's why it's a lot of fun when you, when you get, have friends at home, family. Yeah, that's why whenever I have paella, they always tell you in the restaurant, it's gonna be, if it's fresh, you're gonna be like 40 minute wait. Because yes, of this, somebody's doing that. What yeah. I'm doing? <laughs> if you if you uh, if you go to a restaurant and they give you pie in five minutes, then you know it's not fresh. Yeah. Well, it wasn't made for you. Exactly, and I'm making it for you. Okay, so right. <laughs> yeah, we're doing well. Where's my sangria? Here we go. All right, well we're taking another break. Yes.
Yes. And then we're gonna come back once the paella is getting ready mm -hmm. to uh, eat, right? Or to cool down a little bit? Ah, uh, no, you just eat right out of when it's out of the stove. It's yeah. ready to eat. All right, so when the paella is ready to eat, um, I'm only gonna go back and I'm going to show you um, how it looks and also our, uh, our review. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Bye. Bye. Mm. This is so good. And now, welcome back. I well, mean, I'm sorry, Miguel. It's our show. Sorry. Welcome back. Uh, this is our pretty much finished the second badge. So you never saw the second and the badge. Th but the third glass. <laughs> yeah, so we ran out of red wine, so we put white wine. So it looks like pink now. Pink. It's, like, a little, it's very, yeah. very sexy, though. It's sexy. <laughs> but uh, our dinner is ready, and I wanted to show you guys how it looks and its finished product uh, before we actually serve it and taste it and then give you the review as usual. So one, this is pretty good, even if you combine wines a little bit. Mm -hmm. And remember to have like about three bottles of wine. Our recipe was so short. <laughs> we need way more wine. <laughs> and also remember, if you're gonna have dinner, don't eat all this fruit because you're gonna get full. Exactly. I am pretty full right Leave now. Leave it for dessert. <laughs> so there will be two good containers from my mom's house. But let me show you guys what the finished product looks like. Um, and oh, you're not the finished. <laughs> there you go. That, my friends, it's a seafood paella. And if you Google seafood paella, it pretty much looks pretty similar. Look at the rice. Yeah, but uh, ours is very special. It's just with the different, uh, different, a little bit of uh, different ingredients. So it just it's gonna be so good. You do it this way. And it's pretty easy. Yeah. Very nice. Mm, and happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. So, here, mom, put it here. Right here? Okay, here. So, here, with my studio audience in the back. And my husband over there. <laughs> Woo, really? Happy Mother's so, Day. Yes. Happy Mother's Day to everyone. Um, yes, take care of your Mother's family, Day. love them. And um, I'm Miguel, and uh, this is my. I'm Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> This has been Cooking with Miguel and Riker, special Mother's Day edition. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, subscribe to our page, and uh, we'll see you soon. All right. Bye. Mm -hmm. We'll have more recipes for you. Yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>